how are you? And how's your grooming? I got my beard um, trimmed, I got a haircut. My head is half the weight that it was before, <laughs> it feels good. And if you're allowed to go and see a barber, I thoroughly recommend it. Today, I thought, um, just for no reason at all, I, th I thought I'd have a go at being an influencer. I'm not quite sure what an influencer is, I've heard of them, or I'd go Marie Kondo on you. I'm not, well, I've never seen her at work either, but I think she talks about just having things in your life, in your place, that give you pleasure and get rid of the extraneous stuff. I think that's what she does. So uh, we've all had time to look at our four walls a bit too much in the last few weeks. And um, I realize that some things give me more pleasure than others. Uh, some of them are very banal. And here's one. I collect secretly fridge magnets. I have two rules about fridge magnets. One is that I have to find them myself. Uh, there's no use uh, anyone buying me a fridge magnet because I don't, that's not the point. The second thing is they have to be really tacky. And this one from Malta is about as tacky as it gets with that horrible frame, a badly drawn bust. It's just perfect. It looks really good on my fridge. And paintings, of course. Paintings are very important in my life. And here's one that I commissioned. It's by Marjorie Williams. She is from the Tangentieri Artists in Alice Springs. And it gives me an enormous amount of pleasure. When we're doing Sweet Country, this is my Jabal Jari brother, Hamilton Morris, uh, who's, who was the lead in Sweet Country. And this pink guy is me. And it's a, it's a painting that for me is really very touching and it's sort of hilarious too. I think it's just fantastic. I might talk about other paintings some other time, but in the meantime, how was I as an influencer? Did I pass master? I don't know. I don't know.